Okay, let's chat making thieves wipes. So why do I like to make thieves wipes? Well, part of it is when you go to the store and you buy those canisters of wipes, you buy it for a reason. They're really convenient. They make cleanup really easy. And as strange as it seems, sometimes grabbing that spray bottle of cleaner and a roll of paper towels is, is just not as convenient as grabbing a wipe out of a canister. So I want to show you how to make Thieves Wipes for less than you could go and buy a good quality wipe out of the store. These will run about $2 per canister and we'll just get started. Okay, so here's what you're going to need. You'll need a high quality roll of paper towels. You can get Bounty, uh, but I actually like to use Costco Kirkland brand. They're really thick, they're really good, they're really gonna stand up under the, uh, under the wet cleaner. So get a high quality one. Now keep in mind, each roll is gonna make two uh, separate canisters of wipes, so you're gonna save one of these for the next batch. So it's gonna be really cost effective. So you need that. You also need Thieves Household Cleaner. Uh, this kind of puts the big cleaning power into your recipe. You also need to have distilled water. Why not tap water? Well, for a couple of reasons. There is nothing bacteriologically in distilled water, which makes it a better choice for making these wipes because they stay fresher longer. And then I have uh, kind of an array of different oils you can use to add to this. Uh, sometimes I use lemon. I always use a little extra thieves. You can use tea tree, and I often like to use eucalyptus. So let's get started making them. So the very first step that we're going to take is we're going to cut in half the roll of paper towels. Some people like to use a, um, like an electric knife. I don't have an electric knife. Um, I just use a regular serrated blade. It's going to look a little bit like messy, but that's okay. Don't worry about it. So you find the halfway point on your roll and you just saw till you get there. Okay, now you have your roll of paper towels cut in half. It could take you a couple minutes and the better your uh, paper towels are, it'll take you a little longer than if you had like a cheap brand. Which please don't waste your money on the cheap brand because these will all fall apart and you'll waste all of your ingredients. So get the good ones. So you're gonna have some like little linty stuff that's going to be at the end of it. Just brush it off. Just brush the lintiness off. You're going to keep the paper towel core in there because it'll end up being able to come out at the end. Save your other half, somewhere safe, to use for your next batch whenever you use this one up. So now we're going to get started. First thing we're going to do is take this, we're going to put it inside this container. So I have this container called an Omni Wipe container and you actually can put it in and it has them so that the, um, the wipes can pop up through the top and then it closes to keep them fresh. Now if you don't want to get an Omni Wipe container, it's a little investment, that's okay. Just use an old coffee can. But here's the thing, don't put a hole in the top for them to come through because it'll make yours dry out. Just lift the lid and pull them out and then close it again. All right, so I'm going to brush some of this out of the way, get rid of this because I'm all done cleaning that. Now, in a glass measuring cup, I'm going to add one and a half cups of distilled water. This will keep your wipes fresh. If you go through them slowly, you want to make sure that you're adding, especially that you're using distilled water. Also, distilled water does not contain minerals, so if you're wiping down glass, it'll keep it from leaving any kind of residue. Next, we're going to add a cap full of Thieves Cleaner plus a little extra. You don't want to put too much in because if you do, you'll end up possibly making it a little soapy, which isn't good for wipes because you don't want to have to rinse after them. So I'm going to put in about a cap full and a half. You can experiment and see what you want the cleaning power to be after you do your first batch. Now, for this batch, I'm going to add three extra drops of Thieves. And sometimes I use the tea tree, like I said, other times I use lemon, but today I'm going to add three extra drops of eucalyptus 
because it helps to amp up the cleaning power, just like adding the thieves. They also help to keep them fresh, which is super important when you're making wipes um, because you don't have any harsh chemical preservatives in them. So you want to make sure that they stay fresh. All right, now you want to give it a little stir. You can use a spoon, but I have this handy, so use what you got, right? Let's give it a little gentle stir. You're going to place your paper towels into here, uh, into your container. And if it's bigger than your container, go ahead and make some extra, pull some off to make some space. But mine fits exactly. So now you're going to take your solution and you're going to pour it over it. Just kind of distribute it pretty evenly around. And you're going to let this sit for 15 or 20 minutes until everything has absorbed. And then you're going to pull the core out. So you're going to put your cover on it and you're going to go ahead and let it sit. So let's let it sit. Okay, so now we've waited and we can take the middle part of the paper towels out. So we go ahead, we pull it out because it's all wet. We dig in and get the last tiny bit of it. And now you can see, you can just pull up that center wipe from the center. And if you have the Omni wipe container, you can just feed it through. And then when you're ready, tuck it down and it will completely close up and stay fresh and moist. Now, if you're using the coffee can, remember, don't try and feed it through an opening in the lid. Just reach in and pull it out from the lid. Now, I hope that you enjoy using your new Thieves wipes. Um, if you find that your wipes are too moist, just use a little bit less water when you make them. And you can use these to clean anything. Toilets, I love it for my kids to clean up after themselves in the kitchen. It's really, really useful. Anywhere you'd use the wipes you buy in the canister, you can use your Thieves wipes. Enjoy!